opportunities for others to abandon the hatch and greeting the Expedition 73 crew on June 6, ranging from human physiology to space radiation impacts, a host of research technology demonstrations. It typically takes almost three days uh, for the compensatory mechanisms to kick in and for them to have uh, a robust uh, uh, lifestyle as we have on Earth. Uh, but three to seven days is uh, then uh, a, a, another additional time given for them to completely recover so that they can uh, be uh, free of any more monitoring. So we will be learning as uh, in this particular case as to how long exactly Shubanshu takes to fully recover and become fit for normal duties on Earth. Receiving great big hugs from Nicole Ayers and the Expedition 73 crew. Axiom at Mission 4, welcome aboard the International Space Station. Pilot Shibanshu Shukla flight for Peggy Whitson, her return to the International Space Station on her fifth flight, second as a member of Axiom Space. When these uh, astronauts are exposed uh, to uh, the zero G in the ISS and uh, the body gets how shall I say, uh, de-acclimatize uh, or uh, it, it uh, uh, decompensates with the normal ability to stand up in a 1G environment on Earth. When we stand up from a lying down posture, suddenly our ability to keep up the blood pressure uh, to the brain uh, is uh, is there because, uh, because we have compensatory mechanisms. These get subdued once we are exposed to zero G. And so therefore it takes a long time for pilots to get used to the one G of uh, the earth, uh, especially the cardiovascular system as also the neurovestibular system because they're also now uh, coming back to one G from zero G. Station, welcome again to Axiom Mission 4. And we are continuing to target. And this crew maintained a very full timeline. But they prepared for this. So our internal ears, the semicircular canals and otolith organs, especially the otoliths, they work in the 1G environment and they are floating uh, in the 0G. And so they also need time to come back uh, for our ability to sense, let's say, head movements up and down. All these things take a while uh, to return.